hey guys welcome back to my channel thrifty mommy and happy friday so i'm about to head out today to do my weekly shopping haul over at publix we have some really good deals we have a brand new ad that did start yesterday and then we have an extra savings flyer that is going to be expiring today we have a new one coming out on saturday and there's one deal in particular that will be expiring today with that extra savings flyer and it's on the hellman's mayonnaise now by now probably all the shows are cleared out so if you don't find it at your store and you still want to go ahead and pick up the deal make sure you grab yourself a rain check and keep those extra savings flyer coupons they're still valid after they expire as long as you have your rain check then when they come back in stock, you can go ahead and pick them up with no issues. And then that digital coupon, the five off of five for the Unilever, that one doesn't expire till May the 12th, which is the following Friday. Um, so you have a little bit of time. You have about a week to go ahead and pick up those helmets and mayonnaise as long as you have the rain check and you keep your extra savings flyer coupons. That's probably what I'm going to have to do because by now, probably my shelves are completely bare. Another great deal this week is on the 10 of pads. So if you happen to not find them in your store and your shelves are bare, make sure you pick yourself up a rain check as well. Keep your coupons because when it comes back in stock, you can go ahead and pick it up as long as you have that rain check. So those are some good tips for you guys in case there are some deals that you want to pick up. They're not available. Don't be bummed about it because there's other ways around it like picking up your rain checks. One more thing I wanted to bring up is this whole thing about Ibotta by now. You guys might have heard that Ibotta has put a new disclaimer on all of the rebates for every single store saying we cannot use coupons um, for the rebate deal. Now, it doesn't specify if it's a digital coupon, a paper coupon, or even an in-store coupon. Um, when it first came out, it did state the same exact thing. Then they fixed it, put that you cannot use paper coupons when you're at Walmart. So it was only at Walmart. Now it's at every store. So we're trying to find out again if it's digital, paper, if it's all of the coupons, what is it? We haven't gotten a clear answer. So we're still trying to find out. For now, I'm going to continue to read all of the rebates. If it does say not to use um, coupons, I'm not going to be using paper coupons. I just might use um, digital coupons and then I'll submit to the coupons.com app. That's what I'm going to be doing. You can do whatever you feel comfortable with. Um, but for now, it's not really clear on um, what Ibotta is trying to do. But they're always changing. Just don't be discouraged. Continue couponing and getting the items that you need for your family. It is getting a little bit tighter with the couponing but you can still get some really good deals out there. So you guys, I'm gonna head out um, to Publix, grab my deals, and then I'll show you guys an end of the video screenshot with everything I picked up and final details. So let's head out to Publix and grab these amazing deals. First thing I'm going to be picking up is going to be on the Pearl Milling Company Pancake Mix. So they're buy one, get one free at $4.31. I'm going to pick up specifically the Apple Cinnamon because we do have an amazing Ibotta rebate. So if you pick up two of these, you can use a dollar off of two Publix Digital, or you can head over to the Tasty Rewards site and print off this dollar off of two coupon. That'll leave you to pay in store just $3.31. Then you can submit your receipt over to Ibotta for $8.50 back on each one, making your final cost for two boxes just $0.31 cents or $0.16 cents each. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick up a total of four boxes. I'm going to be using the dollar off of two Publix Digital, and then I'll use one of the printables, and I'll get four boxes for just $0.62 cents or $0.16 cents each. The Pearl Milling Company syrup is also on sale. Buy one, get one free at $4.21. But unfortunately, we cannot use this a dollar off of two coupon because the Ibotta rebate does indicate that you cannot use coupons. So you can just pick up two of these at $4.21, submit over to Ibotta for 50 cents back on each bottle. That'll make your final cost for two of these just $3.21 
or $1.60 each. Now, another option is to pick up the Mrs. Butterworth's syrup. It is also buy one, get one free at $4.29. Over on the Publix app, we have a dollar off of two Publix Digital. That'll make your final cost for two of these just $3.29 or about $1.65 each. So it really depends which one you wanna pick up. If you wanna knock out and I bought a rebate, pick up the Pearl Milling Company. If not, you can pick up the Mrs. Butterworth and just use the Publix digital coupon. Another great deal on the Kellogg's bars is on the Nutri-Green cereal bars. These are buy one, get one free this week at $4.31. You can pick up one of these. Use a dollar off of two coupon from the Kellogg's website as well. It is a separate coupon. And that'll make your final cost for two of these just $3.31 or $1.66 each. Next thing I'm going to be picking up is going to be on the Kellogg's Pastry Crisp. These are buy one, get one free at $3.09. I'm going to pick up two boxes and I'm going to be using this dollar off of two coupon that I printed off of the Kellogg's website. That'll make my final cost for two of these just $2.09 or about $1.10 each. Now, all of the coupons I'm going to be mentioning in this video, I'll have them linked down below in the Google Doc. It'll be easy for you just to click on the link and print off the coupons so you can use them in the store. There is also another deal on the General Mills cereal bars. So these are buy one, get one free this week at $4.19 as well. But this one has an Ibotta rebate. So you're going to pick up two boxes, submit to Ibotta for 50 cents back on each one. That'll make your final cost for two of these just $3.19 or $1.60 each. Next, I wanted to mention this deal on some coffee in case you are in need of some. So the Lodasa coffee is buy one, get one free at $9.99. You can pick up the grounds or the K-cups. Just pick up two bags or two boxes. Use a dollar off of one Publix Digital, and then you can submit your receipt over to the coupons app for a dollar back on one. That'll make your final cost for two just $7.99 or $4 each. Next deal I wanted to pick up was on the Hellman's, but as you can see, it is completely out in my store. This is what I was mentioning at the beginning of the video. Don't be discouraged because you can get a rain check for this item and then you can pick it up at a later time. But I'm going to give you guys the breakdown. So these are buy one, get one free this week at $5.19. You're going to pick up a total of six. That will total you $15.57. We have a Publix Digital. It is a Unilever Digital coupon for $5 off of five. And then for the sixth jar, you're going to either print off a coupon from a Unilever email if you have signed up for some, or if you have previously found any hang tags, you can use the dollar off of one hang tag. Then you're going to go ahead and use six of these two off of one coupons from the extra savings flyer. Now this will be expiring on Friday, but if you do get the rain check, just make sure you save your coupons. You can use them at a later time, even though they are expired. That'll make six of these jars completely free and a $2.43 money maker. Now, another option would be to pick up the 20 ounce bottles. So these are $6.49 on BOGO. You're going to pick up a total of six. That will be $19.47. Same deal. You're going to use that five off of five Unilever Publix Digital. And then for the sixth one, you're going to either use the printable or a hang tag. Then use six of the two off of one extra savings flyer coupons. And that'll make your final cost for six of the 20 ounce bottles just $1.47 or 25 cents each. So if you don't mind getting the money maker and you rather get a larger like amount, then you can go ahead and pick up the 20 ounce bottles and do that deal. But if not, just go ahead and save your rain checks and wait till they till they're back on stock. And then you can go ahead and pick up your items for completely free and a little bit of a money maker. Another deal you can pick up this week is going to be on the Body Armor drinks. This week they are on sale 10 for 10. You're going to pick up a total of four bottles. That'll be $4. Over on the Publix app, we have a dollar off of four Publix Digital that you can go ahead and use. That'll take off a dollar on the four, making your final cost for all four just $3 or $1.33 each. 
Next, I'm going to pick up an amazing deal on the Good Foods guacamole. This week, they are buy one, get one free at $4.19. I'm going to pick up two containers, and I'm going to be using two of these dollar off of one coupons that I printed off of coupons.com. You can print off one paper coupon and then submit the other one to the coupons.com app, whichever way you want to go ahead and do it. That'll make your final cost for two of these just $2.19 or a dollar 10 each. Now for all of my moms out there that do have wick like I do, this is an even better deal because you can get two of these four completely free. All you have to do is pick up one original and if you want to pick up a spicy, you can go ahead and do so. Just make sure you scan the original first and then the spicy and you can use both of your coupons and both of these items will be completely free any $2 money maker after coupons and wick amazing amazing deal next deal i'm going to be picking up is going to be on the ritz crackers this week they are buy one get one free at four dollars and forty cents i'm going to pick up two boxes i don't have any coupons or rebates so i'll pay about 220 per box i don't mind paying that amount since this is a kitchen staple in my home then what i'm going to do is submit my receipt over to stockings free if you guys haven't heard about stockings free it is a loyalty program with Publix where on participating products, you can track towards a spend 50, get a $10 gift card. So there's a long list of items that you can go ahead and pick up. Every single time that you pick up an item, it will track towards that spend 50, get $10 gift card. You don't have to do it all at once. It does track over time. Now, when you go ahead and reach your threshold of the spend 50, you will get that $10 gift card. You can have it mailed to you or you can have it digitally where at checkout you can enter your phone number, which is your loyalty, your public's loyalty card. And that um, $10 gift card will be there to use on your next shopping trip. So a great, great deal. It does end at the end of the year. So you can continue to track towards those spend 50, get $10 gift cards. And you can get up to 12 per year. So a great option. And there's so many items that work with this loyalty program. Next deal I wanted to mention was on the Purex pod. So again, these are completely out in my store. So if you wanna do this deal, you can definitely pick up a rain check and do it at a later time. But you're looking for the 28 count. They're marked in my store for buy one, get one free at $7.99. So you can pick up two bags. Use two of these two off of two coupons from the bundle of good pamphlet. I believe they are no longer available in store. So hopefully you guys pick some up when you did find them. That'll make your final cost for two of these bags, just a $3.99 or $2 each after coupons. Next thing I'm going to be picking up is on the Glade Spray. So these are priced at $2.69. I know they are a little bit cheaper over at Walmart, but over at Publix, they do have a larger variety. So sometimes I like to pick up items here at Publix just because of the different scents that they have. So I'm going to pick up one of these. I'm going to submit over to the coupons.com app for a dollar back on one. The reason why I am not using a paper coupon is because the iBottle rebate does say not to use coupons. So just in case, I'm going to submit to the coupons.com app. Then I'm going to submit to iBottle for a dollar back on one, making my final cost for one of these just 69 cents. Next, we have a couple of yogurt deals to mention. The first one is going to be on the So Delicious Simply Yogurt. They're two for $4, but they're buy one, get one free. So you can get two for $2. So you're going to pick up two of these. You're going to submit to Ibotta for a dollar back when you pick up two. That'll make your final cost for two of these just a dollar or 50 cents each. Another great yogurt deal is on the Two Good Yogurt Cuz. This is the one I'm actually going to be picking up. They're buy one, get one free at $1.69. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pick up four. That'll total me $3.38. I'm going to be using two of these dollar off of two coupons that I printed off of coupons.com. Or you can use one printable and submit to receipt over to the coupons.com app, whichever way you want to go ahead and do it. Then submit your receipt over to Ibotta for $0.75 cents back on each one. That'll make my final cost for all four completely free any dollar and 62 cent money maker. Next, I wanted to head over to the front of the store and kind of show you a couple of good deals that are going on in store. They are especially really good deals if you have WIC. So the first one is going to be on the Quaker Instant Oatmeal. They're buy one, get one free this week at $4.79. 
you can get two of these boxes completely free with wick just make sure one is original and then the other one can be any flavor plus quaker is a participating product of stocking spree so you can get some additional points towards your spend 50 get 10 dollar gift card Another option would be on the Peter Pan peanut butter. It is buy one, get one free at $4.35. You can also get that completely free with WIC. And then finally, you can also pick up the classical pasta sauce. This one is buy one, get one free at $3.59. Classical is a participating product of Stocking Spree. So if you pick up two of these jars, you can definitely submit there and you will get some additional points towards your spend 50, get $10 gift card. Walking towards the register, I did find a couple of more great wick deals the first one is on the multi-grain cheerios they're buy one get one free at 719 check your Publix app to see if you have a dollar off of two Publix digital that'll make it a nice little money maker then you can also pick up the pace salsa these are buy one get one free at three dollars and 49 cents just make sure you scan on the wick app to see which one is available to pick up i think it's the original but you can pick up two of these for completely free so it's another great week to pick up some wick items if you do have those benefits but even if you don't and you want to pick these up at buy one get one free they are still a great deal all right guys so this is everything i decided to pick up for this week's shopping haul i did miss out on the hellman's mayonnaise but like i said i'll pick it up at another time since i did get my rain check so for everything that you see here after coupons and digitals i paid 18 dollars 37 in store i went ahead and submitted my receipt over to ibotta got 10 dollars 10 back and then i submitted my receipt over to the coupons app and i got a dollar back for the glade spray that made my final cost for everything that you see here just $7.27. Now, I did have that wick offer for the guacamole, so it took off an additional $3.19. So actually, I paid just $4.08 for everything that you see here. I think I had a great shopping haul. Sometimes the smallest shopping hauls are the best. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. I want to thank you all so much for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. Be blessed and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.